In some of the more practical based subjects such as jewellery making, experts working in the profession often come to lecture and lead classes at London Met. Well, we, we basically have lectures and seminars. For a lecture there could be up to about 50 people and in a seminar there's less than 20. So in the seminar you get to talk to like in a personal level with the lecturer as well as other students and discuss things and you, you can at the same time uh, sort of come up with your own perspective of uh, issues that we discuss but in the lecture basically since there's a lot of people you don't, ha you don't get to talk, you get to listen and basically at the end of the session you can ask questions. The thing about London Met is the, the way that you can structure your course and the flexibility of it. So you could come here and study law alongside um, fine art if you really wanted to. You can also study part time so you can, and you can really easily uh, change between each uh, mode of study as well which is quite good. At London Met I think we've got five libraries, <laughs> so quite a few so there's a lot to choose from. Um, the two main libraries uh, at Commercial Road or Calcutta House um, in City Campus and then in North Campus we've got Holloway Road and Labrook House. And they're, they're all very big, some are bigger than others and um, they're always constantly improving the facilities, maybe getting new computers and I think this year they're actually going to refurbish the whole of the library in North Campus. In the North Campus we've got the, li uh, the library here just on the other side, on the other building. Uh, we've got several computer labs with loads and loads of computers for everybody, you know, uh, we never struggle to find a computer here. We also have sort of a uh, super lab, which is the biggest kind of dedicated science lab in Europe, um, with some phenomenal facilities in there. It's this, this, this kind of whole centre is state of the art, it's absolutely fantastic. Yeah. 